Welcome to the 2024 Perioperative Power List interview series. My name is Carissa Brewster. I'm the writer for Whitman Partners. Um, the Power List Award recognizes perioperative professionals who have been elevated to this complex role due to their business acumen, big picture thinking, and solid clinical foundation. Today we have Will Bryant. Um, Will, can you tell us your current role and facility? Yes. Uh... Good afternoon, Carissa. My name is William Bryant. I am currently the Senior Vice President for the Procedural Platforms um, at Christiana Care, which is based out of Wilmington, Delaware. I've been in the role for approximately three years now. Yeah, so, uh, you know, one of the things, uh, two immediate reflections come to mind um, in so much that, you know, we as individuals are responsible for how we show up, how we present ourselves, uh, how we act, how we interact, how we respond, you know, uh, the, the degree of happiness that we experience, that we enjoy, and that we convey, right? The other is, you know, we as leaders are responsible for creating the environment in which our caregivers can thrive and be successful. When we do that, um, knowing that we, you know, if you're in a system leadership role, no matter how big, how many places you oversee, you know what your FTE count is and, and the like. When we do that, we have to appreciate the fact that we're not doing this by ourselves, but we're creating an ecosystem uh, of, um, you know, like minded, shared mental modeled individuals um, that can help facilitate that and, and cascade the message forward. So, you know, that that largely is our role um, in many respects to, you know, you're you know, you're the bridge in most instances to the senior leadership team of some variety. Um, you know, you're translating the vision, um, you know, the, the horizon, the strategy, the true north of the organization and, and making it making it clear that, OK, you know, from from you down uh, and from, you know, from the team, the front line up, you know, this is the expectation and this is how we're going to conduct ourselves. And, you know, when it when it happens, well, it's like being in an operating room when when you're in the middle of a great case, it's like it's like. Um, being part of an orchestra like everything is just flowing and um, you could just indulge yourself in the moment for hours upon end but when it's not you know that becomes a recipe for people to you, you know to maybe not present as the best version of themselves uh, the toxicity of the environment attrition associated with the caregiver in their role and, and in addition to kind of reputational damage that you begin to sustain as a place that uh, you know the next person uh, may not want to be a part of. So we we do have a responsibility, um, you know, to to ensure that the 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 expectation of your environment of care is upheld, that it's known, and it and that is translated every day. We're not always going to hit the mark 100% of the time. But through the lens of continuous improvement, if you're on that journey, more often than not, you're going to land where you need to be. Within Christiana Care, love and excellence is our our, our value pillars. And we, we say, you know, where love is on display or love is present, excellence will follow. And, you know, that's a, you know, a mantra that we hold ourselves to as part of our daily huddle. Um, and it's really cascaded within, you know, within everything that we do operationally, strat strategically, um, and everything in between. So, yeah, it's a long-winded answer, but uh, system leaders, you know, they do have, we have tough challenges and, you know, you got to build out the infrastructure, the team, the workflows, and, and just the model of, you know, this, this is, this is where we're headed. And for everyone that is part of that, the core, um, of that team that this is what we need from you to deliver upon the promise of consistent excellent patient care i think that's a great note to end on <laughs> thank you so much will for uh talking with me today absolutely <laughs>